File test eight. Listening one. One. Mr. Boardman had been the main suspect in the police's investigations for several years. However, when it came to the trial, the jury decided that there was not enough evidence to prove that he had committed the crime. As a result, he has been released and this morning walked away from the court as a free man. Two. Early this morning, a member of the public contacted the police to say that she had seen a man acting suspiciously in the car parking area behind the bank. Police acted immediately. They surrounded the bank and caught the robber as he emerged. The man has now been taken to police headquarters for questioning. Three. According to the judge, although it was the young woman's first offence. The crime was serious enough to earn some time in prison. He ordered a three-year sentence, but with the option for early release for good behaviour. Four. Police had long suspected that Mr. Anderson was involved, but they had never managed to provide enough evidence to prove he was guilty. However, the evidence this time was clear. His fingerprints were found at the scene, and a search revealed that he had hidden the stolen car in his girlfriend's garage. Five. There has been an increase in the number of crimes of this nature recently. Local police have warned that any damage to property, whether it belongs to individuals or the public authorities, will be thoroughly investigated, and those responsible will be brought to justice. They hope that tough action will put an end to antisocial behaviour in the area.